Hey guys, it's May May and my trusty sidekick. Oh, Beanie's here. Welcome to the Tuesday afternoon live show. Did y'all notice anything different today? Do the this, Beanie. The sidekick is back today. Do this. Hey, shenanigans is back. I'm here. I'm here. So what's up today, May May? What's up today is a lot of stuff, so we got to get going. We have a lot to tell you about. The first thing I want to do, as you can see on your screen, is I want to tell you about the Great Fall Garden Festival. Now, you're going to see a video we filmed probably tomorrow about this event, but I just want to show it to you real quick. If you have not heard about this event, it is happening September 9th in Jemison, Alabama. It is at Petals from the Past, which is, y'all probably heard me talk about um, um, Antiques in the Garden, Holly goes there a lot. If you know my cousin Holly, she's there a lot. Um, Jason from Cog Hill and Brooke also are there a lot. Lots of um, people that you know talk about Petals. Well, Petals is doing a meet and greet. And I'm going to scroll a little bit and show you. This is the information about the festival. Okay. You can register that you're going to attend. It's, it's free to attend. They just want to kind of know a number. And then when we get down here, what I want you to see is they are doing the coolest thing. This section here, this is a harvest contest. And what this is, is basically county fair style crafting and homemaking and things like that. So you can enter a project or more than one to be judged to maybe win a blue ribbon. And so they have every category you can imagine, including paper crafting, including knitting and sewing and crocheting and cooking and woodworking, all the categories. Okay. Then there's a meet and greet from nine to four. And I'll show you all the YouTubers that are going to be there. There's some merch. If you want to pick up some merch and look at all these people that are going to be there. Look at this list. That's a lot of folks, you guys. So all of these folks, you can go and you can come and meet. Okay. Here's the information on the date and the time and all that good stuff. And even better, there's going to be speakers. There's going to be different um, topics that are talked about in their building mm -hmm. that they have. So they'll be doing all these stories and all this talking about things. See all this? A lot of fun. All right. So we want you to be there. If you come to our tent, the May May Made It tent will be included with the Brenda Berry tent and the So Charming tent. We're all going to be together and we're going to be doing make and takes. So we'll have a make and take, a paper craft make and take at our booth, and there'll be a sewing fabric craft for So Charming. Super fun. We're also doing giveaways all day. We'll be doing a giveaway every hour, and Brenda Berry's going to be doing a giveaway every hour. She says of some vintage things, you guys, and um, So Charming is going to be doing a giveaway every hour. So you don't have to be present to attend. I'll make sure I say, or present to win. You do have to be present to enter, but you don't have to be present to win. So there you go, guys. I just wanted to tell you all about that. You'll hear more later. There's more coming. Um, let me do a little switcheroony. And I was afraid that wasn't going to work. Let me, I don't, I'm learning. Give me a second. Let's switch this around. Um, I don't know what I just did. <laughs> Let's go back and see if we can figure it out. Y'all may have to talk amongst yourselves for a minute. Okay, I got it fixed now. Where you jump us. Yeah, I just slung us around everywhere, like every scene that was available to us. So, experience it all. Any questions about the Garden Festival? Tamitha put Don't the link in for you guys. Jemison, Alabama. If you're familiar with where we are, it's about 15 minutes down the road from us. Not very far. Yeah, a little north from of us. Shannon, everyone wants to hear an update from you. I better. Not completely great. I got some jaws. But I'm better. Sorry if I have a coughing fit. She could have a coughing fit. She might even have to leave the room. Y'all just know. Um, I'll try and turn my mic off and not cough in here. But she's here, and that's I'm what here, counts. Back. She's here. So, y'all know what y'all want. Y'all want a Mente walkthrough. Y'all want oh. Mente to be in the store for you. You oh. want all of that to happen. And I'm going to tell you that it will happen, but not first. <laughs> um, the Mente is in store. You don't, we don't know, do we? I believe Mente is in store. I believe it is back in store. Tamitha probably knows even. She was probably looking. But um, Mente is back in store. But I got to show y'all something. And it does have to do with Mente. So this is their autumn book. This is a new book that they just um, brought out. Look, my camera's backwards again. It's like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. How funny. You guys, hang on just a second. I think I. Um, oh, yeah. It's in the store. Y'all go buy it. Is this backwards for you guys? Is this backwards for you on the screen? No. no okay. So this is the new book from Mente. It is called The Autumn Book. It's not the new book. There's other new books. But this is one of them. Well, I 
fell in love with this book. Do you see these scenes? Look how gorgeous these are. Just beautiful. But here's what got me is these pages right here. I think these pages are stunning and I have an idea for this book. And some of y'all are not going to love my idea. And some of you are going to be like, yes, I get it. Okay. So I'm going to show you my idea. What I want to do is I want to go through here. You get four of each design. So don't panic. Okay. You get four of each design. I want to pick out, matter of fact, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to pull out each of these. That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do it. You do you with your papers, okay? But I've never seen pages sized exactly for my albums like this. You know what I'm saying? Norm, like when have we ever seen a six by eight page with a scene size like that? Seriously, right? So pretty. So I'm going to pull these out. I think there's five different scenes. There might be more. There should be six. I'm ruining my book. Pages. Yeah, ruining my book, but it's okay because I plan to use it all anyway. All right, so here's what I've got is all of the scenes, right? And what I want to do is I want to pick one. There's, it's technically seven because I pulled leaves out twice. No, that's six. Look, six. Okay. I want to pick one of these pages to be the front of an album. Won't that be pretty? And then I want to use them in the album. I just think they're so beautiful. I am need to use this one, but I also love this one, and I also love this one. It's so hard to decide, isn't it? Cover? Yeah. So we have three to choose from. Three to choose from. Y'all agree with Vince? This one. Or the sidewalk. This one? I picked one you like didn't choose. This one? No, I have a plan for that. So I have a plan for this. We gotta pick the from these two. Vinny said the gate. Benny says the because gate. Because you can, I mean, if you wanted to build on the page, you can I would pick the pumpkins too. You can pick whichever page you want. It's, it's yours. Yours. You get to do you. Yours. You know what? I'm not going to do this because I have an idea for it. I just had an idea for that one. But I am going to do this because I'm in love. Look, you guys, perfectly okay. done for us, right? But we got to ink this. We can't put this straight on. Let's see what cookie dough does. Shannon? I like I've fallen in love with cookie dough for ink. I have fallen in love with it. And it's just beautiful. I'm going to see what this does. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it right here. Ooh, it's too light. I'll be here all day with this. I'll be here all day. We're not doing that color. We'll do a different color. We're going to um, do what? It's the 49 Market Landscape album. And, and we do have some. Right we do have some, right? Yes, we do have some in stock. Let's just vintage photo this. <clears throat> what do you think? Vintage photo. You're welcome. Here we go. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. Yeah, you could do this for multiple albums. That was something else I was telling Shannon. I'm like, some people aren't going to like how I'm going to do this. But you could totally do this for multiple albums. Y'all, I'm not too stressed about how this looks. It's not going to really show. I just want to knock the white back. You could go pretty heavy with this if you wanted to. This time my mic sounds like it's far, far away. But Vince's did that the other night. Eat it. Put your earphones on, babe, and see what. Put your ears on, good buddy. Still got a green light. <laughs> <coughs> hey, did we figure something out the other night when that was the thing? Do you remember? You held your mic. He held his mic the whole show. Of course, he's both. My mic doesn't sound good either. Does your sound okay? Oh. Me? Yeah. Probably. Mine's always louder than y'all's. I don't know why. And what's Shannon sound like? Well, 49 and Market Landscape album. I don't know what else to say. I think Shannon's It's like May May's mic is picking up my, your board, my voice. I think Shannon's mic sounds better than mine and yours together. In here, anyway. So, I don't really know. It could be me over here somewhere. I could have something picking up, but I don't see it anywhere. If it is. You know? Is she muted? Um, I, I'm muted. Uh-huh. But I don't see where she's picking up anywhere. Let me see something. Oh, you know what? Let me check something. This may be what I figured out the other night, too. It is. 
ladies and gentlemen. Mm, my oh, didn't want me in here. There we go. I just was trying my to be channel my mic. On purpose. On purpose. On purpose. She messed up my mic. I was like, this will be fun. <laughs> Let's can see how many people I can get mad at Do me I about Shannon's better? mic. Let's see how That's many people it. I can make you fixed mad. it. I found it. My man just likes being a hero. You know what? I need an IT guy. Anybody mm -hmm. know one? Joe? <laughs> Anybody know an IT guy? Joe, Joe. Some of you are watching me ink and you're freaking out because some people do this really, really like precise. But I'm not that person. I just ink. I just uh, ink. You made me ink. I'm perfect now. Well, babe, now I know it was wrong the other night too when you had to hold your mic. I'm sorry. Well, there isn't a final product yet. She hasn't made one. This is a craft as you go project. That's all I do is craft as you go. So many Pretty people much. um enjoy seeing the project first. I just don't I usually don't have the project. Yeah, sometimes I mean even if there's kind of a before project, it's made with scraps and it doesn't match and it's ugly colors, but it's just to make sure if we had to measure something, measurements are right. So we can tell y'all measurements. They know I use my scraps for templates. We've <clears throat> talked about that. And the colors I don't like. We do a lot of orange and purple stuff because we don't like them. I'm not going to do this whole album today, by the way. I just want to show you a couple ideas. Oh, there's an IT gal in the house. Ooh, I need that. It is Welcome an album. First time lover. I'm not going to try to say who, what your name is. <laughs> We love you too, though. Yay, I'm glad you're here. Vinny last week was asking everybody where they heard about us from. He's so interested with so many new um, new viewers. I'm interested too. All right, so that's roughly inked. Roughly. I will Are do better. The, the top, so the inside pages too? I will do better next time. Are you watching me? No, somebody There's else police. asked that question. There's ink police. <clears throat> Vinny, are you the ink police? No, ma'am. Y'all be careful. I don't really know why. I mean, I could do that when I get to the pages. Okay. So let's put a, let's glue a piece on. I just want to glue a piece on. I just want to do it. Now look at the difference. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. It's so pretty. I'm going to regret that. I'm not going to do it. What are you gonna this do? is what y'all be mad at me about. Right here. Don't be mad. Don't there's, be mad. There's, there's three a, more pages. And there's an A and a B side. You can use whichever side you want. It, it's not two separate pages. It's one page. You get you to pick front and back. But isn't this beautiful? Gorgeous. Oh That's my why they can give you multiples so you can do yeah, that. Have y'all ever seen a page to. more perfect for an album cover? That is so I mean, pretty. Honestly, honestly. Now let's put one on the back. And y'all know me. I'm going to use one of these leafs. This one or this one? As a matter of fact, I like this one least, so it's going on the back. You never see it. Don't panic. Is anybody panicking? No panicking, run. Nobody panicking seems run. to be panicking. This paper smells so good, y'all. Oh. Yeah, if you're watching us on YouTube, be sure to give us a thumbs up. Thumbs up. We always appreciate those. Um, there are several people saying they vented the video. That's all that means. We encourage people to give us a like. And in one of the, I think it was the craft roulette when my mate was on that, they called it Vinny in the video. So if you see people saying we Vinny'd it, that's what that means. If you're watching on Facebook, you can give likes and stuff. You can do that um, there too. I didn't realize that. You can. Cool. You so sure again. Like us on Facebook too. All right. I'm not putting anything here yet because I have another idea, but I want to show y'all something else. Okay. Remember how I told you that I have that other page. Sorry that I had that other page that I had an idea for. Turn this around and see if I want to. Nope. Okay. This is the thing. Here's an idea that I think will be cool. If we were to take, not this one, this one. If we were to take this and make it a flip up page, you see what I'm saying? To make, so we don't have to even waste this page. I don't feel like we're wasting anything, but we could totally make this a flip up page. Let me show you how. Okay. That's what I want to do. All right, we have to start here with a ruler. So the first thing you want to do to make a flip up page, okay, is measure this page. 
six and a quarter. So this page is six and a quarter. I want my page to be six and a quarter. However, I need it to have an extra bit on it to flip over to glue down like a binding strip. You could do a separate binding strip, but there's no need because what we're going to do is cut a page that's six and three quarters and, and it'll include a half inch binding strip. And then how wide is this guy? Eight and a quarter. He's a little shy of eight and a quarter, but we'll probably cut him eight and a quarter and cut him down later. So this cardstock, here's something I want to show you, okay? This cardstock from 49 and Market, which is so wonderful, is the same cardstock as those pages. I love that she's released this so we can do this kind of stuff seamlessly. So if you don't have this, it comes in black and white and it matches the pages. It matches her folios. Everything that you get from 49 and Market that's black and white, this is the paper she's using. Hey, so G. Hey, G, let's go ahead and, um, I'm sorry, six sorry and three quarters. You. No, I saw somebody say hey to him. Oh, there he is. Hi, G. Um, I'm going to cut this to six and three quarters, okay? And then I'm going to cut it to eight and a quarter. A little shy of eight and a quarter. A little shy. All right, and then I'm going to score this at six and a quarter. Does that make sense? Six yes. and a quarter, because that's the length, that's the height of our page. <clears throat> So I'm going to come right here and score. And I'm going to do one more thing. I'm going to do one more thing. Yes, it is very sturdy paper. That 49 and market paper. Y'all see it's, that? It's, it's nice stuff. I'm going to take this. I'm going to fold it over. I'm doing my little push with my bone folder trick. Get that folded down nice and crisply. And then... I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to throw down my walkie-talkie. Yes, I have one. And I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to do a little angle cut on these ends just because I don't want all that hanging over. Just like that. Then I'm going to go back to the book. This is how quick this is. It's so easy to do, you guys. And on this page, I'm going to make a flip up. This is going to get glued down at the top just like this. I am a little bit wide. And that's okay. That happens. I'm going to trim off about a sixteenth of an inch of this page just because I don't want it to hang over too much. So I'm going to go like this. Let me do it this way. Trim off just about a sixteenth of an inch. And then I'm going to glue that in. And I'm going to put my glue back here. You could, let me show you something. You could wrap this around the back which might be the better way. Okay, let me tell you your options here. If you wrap it around the back, when you look from at the book from the top, you only have one thickness. Mm -hmm. If you glue it onto the front, when you look from here, it looks a little sloppier, right? We're going to cover it all with paper anyway. So I'm going to open this page up. Yeah, and then I'm going to glue it to the back of here. I think that's a better option. Do you guys add pages to your own books? They will now. It's not hard to do, and you can do them anywhere and in any way. Thank y'all all for the comments. It is nice to be back. It is nice to have her back. I couldn't find anything last week. <laughs> I tried so hard not to call her, like to text her. I was trying so hard. And then finally, I had to film a <clears> video, <throat> and I needed to have a manicure first. Y'all know that means I got to cut my fingernails to film a video. And I was like, I cannot find my fingernail clippers. And what's funnier is... When we were moving in here, Shannon said, you better put these somewhere where you'll know where they're at. And obviously I put them somewhere that I don't know where they're at. So we, we don't know. It was hilarious. I, I told her like, where mine were. Shannon said, I have some in my desk. I was like, thank you. Too funny. All right. So I'm going to ink this up. So you might want to talk amongst yourselves. Arlene says she has, adds pages in her Bible when she wants to make a bigger note. Very smart. That whole binder strip situation opens up a whole <laughs> world to you, doesn't it? It does. The thing I like about this, though, with this 49 and Market, this white and the black paper, you can't tell I added this page. Like, it feels literally like the same book. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, it's nice when you can buy the extended pages of something because then it all matches too. Because white is not all the same white. I just want to use every bit of so this. So pretty. <coughs> Yikes. 
All right, and now I'm going to glue this down to the page that I put in here. Look at that. And I didn't lose any of that scene that way, see? And then I also gave myself more real estate. Isn't that cool? Look how Very. much more we have. And I love this scene. I didn't want to lose it. Now, let's say you wanted to use that gate scene. I have another idea. Because y'all really going to be like, what? What? Y'all won't be. Y'all know me well enough to know. Watch this. We're going to cut it in half. You already knew it, didn't you? I figured you were going to do something with that gate. You going to cut that gate? Can I cut that gate? You can do whatever you want to with that gate because you have three more pages. See? Won't that be pretty? Okay, let's figure out how we want to put it in. Maybe we put it back here in the back and have it. What do you think? Put it right here and have it open. Wouldn't that be pretty? Yep. So if we're going to do that, all we need to do is measure. So here's what I'll do. If I put it here, side where I want it, put it like this it straight. There we go. But put it like this. This page is now uh, four and one eighth. So if I do four and one eighth plus half an inch, I don't really think I want any of this to hang over. I think I want this page to fit the same. Yeah. So I'm going to do four and one eighth plus half an inch by eight, six, 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 which yeah. means this six is not six. Eight. I put into this, didn't I? Yep. Six, five, All right. So I'm going to grab a piece. We'll cut it down four and one eighth. We cannot wait until it looks like fall. However, most of the time here, um, Gareth, um, you see fall in a blink of an eye and it's gone. I'm lost here for a second. I gotta go six. Y'all ignore what cut I just did. Cut your six down. For my brain, it worked. That was really crazy what I just did. Um, it's a solid white piece of paper. <laughs> So four and one eighth, four and one eighth, one, two, three, four. So five and, no, four and five eighths. Four and one eighth plus a half is four and five eighths. I don't know. I'd have to do four and a half and add an eighth to it. Four and four see. eighths plus one eighth is four <laughs> and five eighths. Yes, it is. Four and five eighths. That's how my head works. Okay. Then I'm going to take this, score it at half an inch. Oh, happy late birthday, Miss Blue. Happy birthday to you. Now we're just going to come in half an inch, which is that four and one eighth. Score it there. Score it here. Y'all, if you've ever watched Deneen Craft from 49 and Market, this is, she's like on fire. Like she's so fast, isn't she? And I'm just like, I'm never going to remember all this, but she does the coolest things like, like this. She is not afraid to stick a page in somewhere or make something a lift, or make something a wrap around. She does so good. We get lucky to sometimes get to see her craft in some of the little conventions and things that we get invited to, and she is just really good. Same thing, let's take some cuts out here. Little angles. We got a super chat. Thank you. Y'all ready? <sighs> a little crowd noise for you. Thank you so much. Luann Louder. Thanks, Luann. All right, so we got this. Now, let's go ahead before we put these in the book and glue our gate on. Because I want my gate to be the actual size. That was I absolutely love fall. Crunching leaves is my favorite. Did you see where they were? Right in front of right me. There. Okay, so I'm going to line this up. Make sure you put the right gate on the right side. The right gate on the right side. You're exactly right. Please put the right gate to on the, the right, right hand side. side. And the left gate on the left side. That's correct. I'm getting a little adhesive off. You know, those books have that rubber yep. adhesive. Just peeling that off. All right. I'm going to glue this down. Alicia's birthday is tomorrow. Oh, happy birthday early. Happy birthday early. Okay. I'm going to put this here. I'm going to put it right to that score line, but not crossing over it. That score line is going to need to go back like that. There we go. Yeah, anybody that comes to our October event will have to drive down um, Ollie Avenue, and maybe our tree will be 
changing. Starting to change, um, maybe? Maybe. I don't know. I can't remember. I haven't looked at the dates from previous years because I always take pictures. But there's a beautiful maple tree. Isn't it a maple tree? I think it's a maple. I don't know. I don't know. There's a beautiful tree, and it is gorgeous, and the leaves always change on it. And there's a group of people that just wait for that tree to change and drive down. Like you see posts on Facebook. The tree is changing. The tree is changing. Oh, you know what I didn't consider? That gate's not in the middle. Oh. I don't care. I don't really care. I'm just no, going what I got here. It won't matter. And it's going to be in the middle on yours. It'll fill the middle. But I was like, how is that not matching up? Because it ain't the middle. Somebody else was watching like, that ain't the middle. <laughs> How'd they do it? <laughs> that ain't the middle. <laughs> what was that? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> How they do it, Ben? Yep. <laughs> yep. Yep. That ain't right. That ain't the middle. I love going to the Smokies in the fall. The leaves are always so pretty. Hello, everyone. Some folks are coming in kind of late. Welcome in. You ain't missed a lot. You can guess what I'm doing. There's Mente in the house, so you know I'm covering an album. <laughs> she's, she's doing a quick album with a Mente 6x8 book. Now, you might think, see, that's going to look great. No one cares if that's not the center. You might think you want to cover this page before you do this, but I'm thinking you don't. And the reason I'm thinking you don't is because you want to cover up your little flaps, right? You so once we have these glued down, you're going to want to cover that up yeah. after that. Mm -hmm. Okay, Ooh, but I am pretty piece of that. Um, gonna ink this that colored paper on the back of the one from that. Um, AC, yeah, okay, one of those colors. You're gonna pick something? a color. I love to do that in the fall in these albums. It looks muddy right now, but when it's done, it's so pretty. All right, so let's glue down. Oopsie. I'm gonna start out here. I would rather be closer to the edge than to the spine. So I'm going to place the right gate first, obviously. <laughs> Instead of the wrong gate? Instead of the wrong one. <laughs> wrong gate. Right gate. Place it here. Centering it top and bottom. And I'm using the edge of this um, book. There's a little bit of paper that has a little line that I'm kind of using to line up. Put that there. I'm going to open this up and I'm going to press this down. I've discovered something about our glitter glue. It loves pressure. It works better under pressure. So pressing it down, it's so, so good. And then Shannon's finding me a piece. I'll show you all in a second what she's digging into over there. So what I'll do here is when I glue this down, I'm just going to match them up. Isn't that cool? So easy. Somebody will look at this and go, how did you figure that out? Brilliant. Just say, I'm brilliant. Experience. Mm -hmm. I've done it ain't my first it ain't my first folio. Hey, that's funny, y'all, not rodeo. It ain't my first folio. Too funny. She's I think so I'm funny. Horny. I think I'm funny. <laughs> All right, let's press that one down. Let's lift it There's up. Too many choices. Won't this be so pretty to have like a pretty family photo in the middle or something like that? I mean, I kind of feel like you should do orange. I'm feeling orange, too. And Shannon loves orange, like her second Ooh. favorite color. Oh, like, never. All right, let's do this. This is seven and seven eighths. And what do I want? To, I think I'll go top and bottom. Seven and seven eighths and six and a quarter. Now, this paper I'm going to use here because I'm mixing some together is this guy, which works perfect. Look how pretty this scene is. These papers work perfect with this Mente book. So if you're picking up the Mente book, you should grab this because it's perfect. And you can do a lot with these pages. Seven and seven, eight, six and one quarter. I don't know how I remembered that because it's not like me. Yes, um, she changed to vintage photo. The cookie dough was too, too light. light. It didn't show up. Six and one quarter tall. See what I just did? Y'all catch me? Seven and seven eighths long. I thought that feels a little, a little stocky. A little thick. All right, let's ink. Charlotte says she thinks that red color would have looked better, but was there red on that page? 
Well, I mean, kind of. The red would be pretty. I almost Crimson pulled a brown. Actually, pretty. I almost pulled a green. Is that which? Never mind. I didn't fall for it. It's Charlotte Reagan. I know. I didn't fall for it. It is not ever, I repeat, ever UT Tennessee orange. orange. Never. Because that's that's one not, not flattering color. Even hunter orange, that's dead gum close. Somehow I forget that never everything be called, goes to football in the South. Never be called Tennessee orange. Where's Tina? Has Tina gotten used to that yet? <laughs> I saw her earlier. Look how pretty that's going to be. Look, y'all. This looks like we practiced and studied this out, and we did not. I, I tried to make it look like that. That's good. This is pretty. Get ready for some crimson. All right, I got a question for you because I'm not going to finish this one in the live. We have too much to do. Do y'all want me to film finishing this? Do y'all want to see this as a filmed video? I'd have to run through and show how we got to this point at the beginning for those that weren't watching. But if y'all would like to see, I can do, I can show you because I have other plans in here too that I want to do. You want me to That'd keep going goodie. and do a video for it? It's I so think you should. cute. Yes, please. Yes. <sighs> so pretty, y'all. So today you saw what we did. We covered, look at this. I'm going to put words or something up here. The cover's done, right? I'm going to do something on the side. Don't know yet. Got ideas. Look at this. How beautiful. And I can pull in other items. Um, look how many pages I'm already making for myself. There was something, too, that... Um, Janine did ages ago where she made a pocket and a page really cool. And I wanted to do that. This would be the album to do it in. So um, that's what we'll do. I'm going to finish here for today. Just wanted to show y'all where we were going with these pages and how gorgeous they are. And so Saturday, I'll bring you in part two of this. I think that'll be cool, right? Yeah. I think that album's going to be one of my faves. And we that'll were just funny. talking to the kids this weekend about planning a fall trip. So what a perfect place to put our photos, right? Oh, yeah. All right, then. Oh, maybe that could be our trip. Helen, we could re recreate Helen with the girls, though. We didn't have the girls last time. Yes, the book was um, a pre-made album. It's a 49 and Market landscape album that we have in the store. They're the best things ever. But listen, I'm going to tell you something. They're discontinued, so what I've got is what you get. <clears throat> Here's This is the reason I got so many of them, because Christmas is coming. Y'all know how many I have put aside? This is one of mine today. That's how much I love y'all. Pull one of mine. I have 10 of every one put aside in a bookshelf over here. And these, these have not come back. There is another version, which I have not got in the store yet, because I'm still not sure about it. I think it's beautiful, but I haven't brought it in the store yet. And we can talk about that. But these, you can't get anymore. What I've got is what you can get unless somebody has some somewhere I don't know about. Right? Um, and there may be a pocket somewhere. We might could check now that this kind of settled out because everybody was fighting for them at the same time. But I think we had like 70 of these this morning. Uh huh. And that was it. Right? Yep. That's it. So y'all need to grab those. You just need to have those in your stash. They are the fastest present. Ever. Especially when you throw in a six by eight pad like this um, Mente. We haven't even book. We haven't even cut uh, touched the surface because let me see. Is that mine? Uh huh. Okay. Look. We're going to be able to use all of these pieces, too, in this album. All of this can be used. Look at these windows. I mean, come on. We're not even, we haven't even got there. I'll do it. It may have to be part two and part three because I'm going to have to do a lot of work. So it's hard. It's hard to do 20 minutes of that. You know what I'm saying? All right. Are we ready to look at Mente? Let's do it. So this is restock of Mente and one new pack. From yeah. Mente. But we get to flip through today. We didn't get to flip through last time, and I'm so excited. They do have a replacement for the albums, but it's not exactly like this one. You can see it. It's no big deal. This is how the new one works. The new one is this outside. Y'all tell me if you want me to bring them in. If you do, I will. Okay. It's the outside with no pages attached, and then you can buy pages separate and put them in how you want them. It's kind of an a la carte album. So it's like create your own deal. It's a create your own. I think it is actually called create, create an album. I think create so. album. So like you would have to put everything into the spine like this, which is fine. It's not bad. Um, it's just, I love these. I love being able to pick this up and just go and I just love it. 
But if y'all want me to bring those in, I will. I'll need to try them out. I have one to try out. Mean sent me one. Um, so, all right. That's a yes. They want a however many it takes. Yes, yeah, Sharon said yes, part however many. Okay, we'll get to it. And we'll call it one of part however many. That's what we'll call it. All right, y'all ready? Let's start with this one. Look at this. This has been popular around here, y'all. Do y'all mind if I do something? My camera's backwards, and it's going to drive me insane on this flip through. I need to fix it if you'll just bear with me one second. I can't, I can't do it. Uh, let's see. <laughs> let's Luann, see. did you mean to do that again? Didn't Luann do that earlier? I thought she did. Or maybe it hadn't. Thanks again, Luann. Run out. I don't know. I know that shows it now time. I know what it is. I figured it out. All right. Thank goodness. I was not going to be able to do that. All right. So this pack is called Nana's Kitchen. Are you kidding Can me? You, I think your camera needs to be focused. It looks a little blurry to me, but it could just be me. It looks clear to me. Where's my clock at? It looks clear to you? Yeah. Okay. My hands look clear. I think it's the plastic. Could be. Let's open it up. Nana's Kitchen. This was one of Shannon, Shannon's favorite. And all y'all know it because why? It's Don't green. tell them why. There was Too late. Done, done. But he's like, I know, I know it's green. <laughs> it's purdy. I get excited if I know the answer. He knows it. Oh my gosh. It's purdy, y'all. Why's my it favorite? So good. Nana's Kitchen. Let's go. The studio isn't quite finished yet. We had some work done in yesterday that helped. So we we might be able to we get in there. We might be able to. We we standing out last week. We've had a lot to catch up this week and they didn't get the studio completely finished as far as like lighting until yesterday and we're finishing some shelving. We it's been a it's been a big job. Isn't this beautiful? It is. Did you see this? Uh-huh. I love that curtain. Gosh. It's so cute. Is that a dishwasher? stove what is that so cute. it looks like a hutch with a stove yeah, built it does. in i wish i had that or table cooktop. <laughs> look at this with the food i mean it's definitely a cooktop oh look at the recipes you reckon they're legit i would want to try them cheap <laughs> cheap ginger squares chop suey cake cream puff shells Orange layer cake. There's a lot of recipes. I wonder if they're real. <gasps> Yorkshire pudding. That's so cool. I love that. Look at this one with the stove. Can y'all see this as mystery cards? Or mystery album? You know, we've done a mystery album and it turned out beautiful. Look at this. But look. Can I just have a blouse made of this? This is a Shannon blouse if I ever saw one. Yes. I'll take it. So pretty. I love those plates. Those are very Brenda. Shannon too, but very Brenda. All right, this starts back over. So you get two of each sheet. Stunning. Nana's Kitchen. Now, here's what all you can have in Nana's Kitchen, okay? You can have all the food that she makes, or you can have ephemera. <laughs> and I'll show you what comes in the ephemera. This is the ephemera pack. It is a hundred and... No, it's 60 pieces. And all of that comes in there. All pre-cut for you. Look at those cups. You can get the six by six. Hang on. Same, it's pretty much the same paper, just smaller. And the <clears throat> cut aparts are you have a you have these smaller cut aparts in here as well. So there's that. Or now this is where it gets different. The six by eight is different. Okay, so we'll just flip through. I'm going to turn it on its side for a little bit. Look at that doily. Would y'all believe I just bought a doily? I literally bought a doily at um, Rustic. I had to have it. Are you about to laugh at me? No. I bought buying a hall a doily? tree. And the lady had decorated it with doilies and put stuff. And I was like, I got to have that doily. It was so cute. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, Missy did a whole little um, metal tray and had a canister on it and a, a little 
duck and a doily and something else. And I bought the whole setup the whole she setup. had and took it home and put it on my little table. This is so cute. I like looking in the camera at all the little images. Look at that. So pretty. It's very Brenda Berry. Oh, look. See, I want to do an album. Yes, Teresa, that. the six by six is double sided. So pretty. All right, we've started back over. All right, that's Nana's kitchen. What do you want to do next? School days? I love it too. School days, school days, good old fashioned rule days. It's all it's a good pack. It's all I know. It's a really good one. pack. Are you doing that? Okay. Mm -hmm. Look at this pack. Now, listen, I was on the fence about this till it came in. And now I love it. <laughs> it's beautiful. Why does it smell so good? It does. I don't even know why it smells so good, but it does. It really does. Look how cute. Blue marker. So cute. Lunch bag. Oh, look. It even has the mortarboard, so you could do, like, all the year. All mm -hmm. the. That's cool. Oh, look at that. I bet you could even put that mortarboard on that little kid in um, head. What if you put the, could you put so do you think that's legit chalkboard? Is it just kind of paper? Do what? Could you put this on one of those countdowns and kind of do like month one, two, three, you know what I'm saying? That'd be cute, wouldn't it? Do I think what, babe? I said, can you really write on that chalkboard? I mean, you could with a right, a white pen or something. Look at this. Look I love beautiful. it. So I mean, you could really make it school days if you wrote on the, on the, mark, on the chalkboard. Somebody said it may smell good, but paper factories smell awful. They do. We have one in our town. However, I think it's the ink that smells so good on these. Look how I beautiful want, this I is. I want that hutch. So that gorgeous. Hutch. Oh, my goodness. Look at this hallway. This is the coolest paper pack. And the thing is, if you look at it, you see different things that bring you back to childhood. The stuff on the wall and things like that. Oh, chalkboard. Look at that one. I so love that page. Look at this one. I love that page. This would be super cute in a folio to have your children write some journaling on it and save this, like have it in your folio. That would be really cute. Who told me yesterday I talked in cursive? I said something they're like, you and I said, do you not? Oh, Charity. She said, you just talked in cursive. And I was like, do you not read cursive? <laughs> there you go, guys. And it repeats. So pretty. So pretty. And of this, you can get the ephemera. 60 pieces. They look like this. Are they cute? So dear. I don't know a person that doesn't love Mente. I really don't. There's the six by six. So again, you get some cute little cut aparts and then the same pages, just smaller. Oh, it smells so good. This will make a cute six by six album. And you can make <laughs> a bunch of these, a bunch out of there, I mean. All right, the six by eight is different. Let's look at it. They're so stinking cute. Love this. Oh, you can do it with this too. Like if you have a kindergartner, have them write something in there. It's cute. So cute. Have I called up? Oh, there's flowers in there. That's cute. Yeah. And that one has the pencil page. Love this. So that's available for school days. Then I'm making y'all wait for Christmas and holidays. That's what I'm doing. Or Christmas and fall. Look at this one. This one is called Peony Garden. And I'm going to be honest with you, I have not seen this. Did you open this one? This one is the um, one that we did not bring in the eight. first time. This is the one we didn't bring in the first time. This so this is, is new. new. So if you were here the first time, this wasn't here. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. This is gorgeous. Oh, look at the kitties. I know. It's so pretty. Look at the kitty kitties. Oh, that's one of those fancy greenhouses. I want to play with the kitty cat. Look at that beautiful tree. I love that tree. There's another fancy green now. Have a so um, Deanna, this one is a new one. We did not bring this one in with the original Mente shipment we got wow. earlier. Those peonies we are decided to beautiful. Bring this one in after the fact. I'm going to tell you all, the colors are stunning, and I think the camera is doing a good job today. I think it's really showing it well. There's a little more depth in person, but the colors are gorgeous. Just beautiful. Oh my goodness. This is wedding colors. Pink and green like this. This would be pretty for a wedding. So gorgeous. Look at page. this. Speaking of your doilies. Yeah, speaking of doily. 
Look at that. Oh my God. Cat's here from the first time from Montrose, Scotland. Welcome in, Cat. Look at this cat on this page. Cat, cat. <clears throat> cat, there's a cat. Crackle. I love when they do the crackle pages. I like them. Look at that beauty, beautifulness. Beautifulness. It's beautiful. I love the green wood. I just want it. Tina said, save it. I'll be in after the show. It's because it's got cats on it. He was like, cats! There would be some gorgeous mystery cards from that. Oh, yes. Here's your cut apart 60 pieces and they look like this. That tree is my favorite. It's in there a couple times. Y'all, I know y'all are freaking out about those kitty cats. You know, not everybody does good kitty cats. Those are good. Sometimes they're just kind of like, we could have done better. <laughs> Tina's got cat crying. She doesn't have her kitty right now. Look at this. Ooh. Oh, that was in the big. I just don't remember with the. So beautiful. But let's look at the six by eight, which is also available. What? Oh, they have me at gingham. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look. I, I think I need that in a six by eight. Look at this. I just love it all. That kitty looks so sweet, but y'all know in real life that kitty is planning your demise. It's adorable. It's pretty sleepy. <laughs> that kitty's like, I look sweet and miss it. I'm fixing to jump off this refrigerator onto the top well, of your head. I'm getting on your head as soon as the camera turns off. I'm fixing to jump on the top of your refrigerator and knock Everything your Williams-Sonoma Thanksgiving platter off onto the floor at midnight and wake you up. You think she knows anything about that? Sounds like that's a life experience. That, that, that is, is like, what happened. She's like, I look so precious. Just wait. That is exactly what happened. All right, y'all. How about this one? I love that we have all the sizes and everything. This one is called Antique Shop. Let's see how messy this is. I feel like it's more Brenda. Yeah. I feel like this is Brenda. -y. Oh my God. I get a whiff every time I open it. Do you want a whiff? No, I'm good. Thanks. Just like my menopause fan. It's a good fan. I, my fan is a good fan. Thank you. I enjoy my fan very much. Oh, you don't mean this one? I need to show y'all my fan, but y'all all gonna want them and you can only get them at Rustic that I know of. <laughs> Look how cute this is. Look at this old sewing machine. I actually want one of these. I am looking for one of these sewing machines, but I want it to operate. I want it to operate. To be honest, this is exactly what I'm looking for too, because I'm pretty sure this is a chain stitch machine and that's what I want. And I don't know where I'm going to find one, but I'm looking. <gasps> Are you kidding me? That is beautiful. Are you kidding me? Do you know what I want to do with this page? I want to take some of those um, string lights, the ones from um, Pear Blossom, and poke holes and do little like cafe lights on this page and then put it in a frame, and put it on my wall so I can look at it. It's stunning. Can y'all see that with little cafe lights? That would be, why did y'all not go so pretty <gasps> like that? That was such a good idea. <laughs> Vinny. <gasps> Get this one. I just need to put this in my sewing room. But if Missy's watching, she'll be like, not till you paint it. <laughs> She's mad at me because I got that this. cabinet in my house and didn't paint it. It was already painted. Ish. Look at this. I need sniff Sniffers Anonymous. Y'all, do you just want all this at <coughs> home? Oh, the phone. Wait. Hold the phone. I missed it. Hold the phone. All right, there's a gramophone. Oh, beautiful. What's that? Is that a record player? I think it is. So pretty. So pretty. Look at this. Are Hello. you kidding me? This needs to be an actual hardback album to me, not a folio. This feels like you need to tatter it. So it needs a little more stability than just cardstock. Do you think? Like, it feels like it needs to be kind of torn. This feels like Brenda paper. That or it needs to definitely go on like a black or a khaki oh. colored um, folio. This on black? Are you kidding me? So beautiful. <laughs> so beautiful. All right, let's look at what else we get with it. We get, look, Patricia said, oh, love that idea. 
That's what I heard her say in my I thought head. you said, she probably let's look said, at whales. Love that idea, May May. But I heard, oh, love that idea. Let's look at what else you get. This is 60 pieces that look like this. These cut aparts are worth it, aren't they? Worth um, it. Yes. Look at this. Here's your six by six. Yeah, especially for you that, um, those that don't like to fussy cut, the cut apart. Do y'all remember when we made um, the six by six chipboard album? Brenda and I did a video where we gave each other parameters. We had paper pack and we had chipboard and we did a six by six album with the ring closures. This would be perfect for that. It would be beautiful for that kind of thing. So pretty. All right, let's see how pretty this is. Look at this. Wow. I just want this. I want this in fact. That's your shirt. I love that. Mine was so the much. green one. Yours is that one. I love it so much. Look at that ledger paper. So pretty. Oh, here you go. Look at all these pieces. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, let's start it over there. All right. Are ready for the good part? Y'all are like, this was the good part. And there's those two. It's all the good part. It's mente. Nothing you can do about it. Who wrote for mente? White Christmas. Brace yourselves. I would Welcome, say, Julie. I would say, we've not even looked in this one. Obviously, we have it upside down. I have looked in this one. I ain't going to kid you. I have. I have looked through this one, and it's so pretty. I check it out. Oh, I can't stop yawning, y'all. I'm so sorry. I got yipstick on. I, got I guess it's yours. Stuff. This one's mine. If this one gets shipped to you, you'll <laughs> If that one gets shipped to you, I'll make sure she signs the front of it. That one's mine. Look at this, y'all. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. This makes me so happy. Why does it make me so happy? I love it. Oh, gosh. Look at this. Can I live in this? Can I just live here? You'd be cold. I can put it out in the middle of nowhere. Look at that squirrel. I do love that little squirrel. I'm yeah. I didn't hear that jab. He looked at the um, camera. The Mente Santas catch this, this year. Catch this. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, yeah. Mente Santas this year. They rocked it. They did. It's so pretty. <laughs> it's so pretty. Oh, my gosh. Sorry, I got myself. <laughs> you apologizing now, aren't you? When this camera goes off, <laughs> look at this. Oh, my goodness. I love that they use this kind of teal blue. They've done the teal before, but this one I feel like is more them than the other one was. I feel like the other one was sort of pepperminty, and I feel like this is more minty Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Look at this. Can I please, please just have a whole pack of this? Love it. You've been waiting for this collection, Tam? Why do you say, Tam, that just wait? Look at the Santa. Look at the Santa. Just wait. Just wait. We got something to show you. And then we start over. I just love this pack. Somebody tell me what I'm doing with it because I don't know. I'm doing something with it because I love it. I love it. Okay, check this out. Here's your ephemera pack, 60 pieces, and here's what you get. So pretty. So pretty. And with a just wait, I got something to show you. All right, six by six. I'm going to show you in this show. Just hang on. Look at that Santa with the lantern. Look at this. All six by six. It's just like the other one, just like the big one. But we also have the six by eight. And this one, so good. So good. Look at this. Look at this. I'm loving it. So Look at the stars. Look, that's how you do it right there. Chihuahua camper. I want it. That's what I say too. I want it. Look how pretty. Is that what that says? Chihuahua camper. My Look eyes this. just ain't functioning. This page is really pretty. Look at this one. With that oh, screen really door. Pretty. So cool. Look at all these little posts and things. It's so pretty. Here's some reeds. There's some red snowflakes. Look. So pretty. I love this. All right. Here's what I wanted to show you though. Do you want to make her wait? Do we make yeah. Tam wait? We make everybody else wait. Let's make Tam wait. Christmas book. Wait till y'all see this. Look at this. Is this mine? Yeah. Because I'm going to show y'all something. 
because if you're looking at this today and going, I don't want to do all that fussy cutting, watch this. She's doing it, y'all. Hide and watch. What got quiet in here? I can't cut and talk. That's funny. I couldn't cook and talk. You I can cook and talk. I can cook and talk. I have a hard time concentrating and watching and talking. I gotta get some of that out of my way. You should have let me do it. It would have been so good. It would have been absolutely stunning. Thanks. All them crooked cuts. See what I did there? Yeah, we, I saw what you did there. I don't think he did, but I definitely did. I could have passed it and said, look how good I did, and hand it to Shannon. Clack. Is Clack watching in the middle of the day? gonna be a silent movie he said then we can say anything we want look y'all here's why i did that i wanted you to see how easy that is to fussy cut but look at this element that i get look how big this piece <laughs> is let me just show you the payoff let's say we're gonna put it on an album if clack is watching he's like girl that does not match because you don't hear what i'm saying you see what i'm saying if he's watching in silent I think he was talking about you cutting was inside. It was a solid movie. Look at Maybe. this. Do you see Might how big this piece is? And there's nothing to it. And I'm going to show you something. Ellen said I made it look effortless. Let's get up close. Look how bad that is. Look how bad. Do you see how I just did it and I didn't care? No one else is going to see that either. Do you see what I'm saying? I just think <laughs> I love the way they did these. Okay. Because look how they did the edges. It looks so detailed, but they are not. Look at this. This looks so detailed, but it's a square rectangle. Like well, it's too hot to be working outside. I'm glad it's you're in the office, buddy. You can't be outside today. And I know they look detailed, but I want you to look at the edges. They're not. Do you see how easy that is to fussy cut? And then you could ink that with like the vintage photo. So even if you did mess up around the edge should I this probably not this is really pretty white i don't know it's should pretty. i it's mine let's do it's it it's yours we have three others four others that you can send and things like oh y'all there's four others let's do it and then nobody knows you had a mistake if you did it i mean you would have to call it a mistake because it's your making what you make is not a mistake oh it's so pretty it is gorgeous it is I mean, that's the thing. I'm like, everybody's like, oh, I don't like fussy cutting. This is so easy to get such big payoff from this book. Well, hello, Tina from Alberta. Look at this. It looks hard, we but I want you Alberta to pay attention. I want you to pay attention. There's no crazy stuff. So now many, she's inking. That's right. So I'm many cards out of that. You're not from Alberta, Alabama. But also, look at this one. And they did this with straight lines. I mean, seriously, can you see doing a scene card with this? Like a slim one? So pretty. All right, we're That's starting back over. I just love this book. And this one, again, is called The Christmas Book. This will sell out. Y'all will because you just saw what I did. Hey, and you could get the snow, like a snow marker, and put that one down on a card and do the snow on the bottom of it and the top of it. Yeah, yeah. Are you that smart or people feeding you ideas? No, I'm that smart. <laughs> That's all up in this head. Timothy said, you're killing me, Smalls. Not yet. Hold on, Smalls. Milner now, said, here is the snow Santa. tech on it. Would be beautiful. Yes. Y'all ready? Again, this looks hard to fussy cut. It is not. You bubble cut around the edges. You don't cut every one of these leaves. And you get all of this ephemera. Hang on. Look at these Santas. He is perfect. Mm, mm, Do you see this guy? Look at that. Holly. This is the Santa that comes down my chimney. This jolly is him. Hit. You see how jolly he is? Baby, smile like that. Okay. <laughs> I can put the costume on for you. This is my smile. Santa. I told you, Tamitha. 
I told you, look at the mistletoes and hollies. Beautiful. Poinsettias. Do you say poinsettia, poinsettia, or poin... Ponsetta. Ponsetta. Some say ponsetta. Ponsetta. Look at the candles. Wouldn't this be pretty if you did the little lights? I don't know if y'all have seen... The, I don't think we ever got them in because I don't think she had them when we ordered them. But we will get them in. They have these ones that have a string. Did we get the string light? We only mm -hmm. got the... One light. No, we got the string. the string lights would be cool because you could poke a small hole here and put lights through them. So pretty. And again, this looks like it's a lot, but it's not. You just bubble cut and look at all the ephemera you get. Not including, let me show you this. On these books, when you're looking at them, this is the solid pages that you get on the back. Um, that Santa ain't gonna stay here long. Y'all all know it. Let's see how they say it. Poen said e uh. That's how I say it. Poen said e uh. Are these uh for me to show? She brought them in here. Well, then I guess we're showing y'all. These are back in stock. Christmas fun, the gold pack. This is really pretty. I used this for something. We the, used the those star. for the stars. Star, but I used the big sheet for it. But look how cute these are. Look at this. These and you are don't even need a full machine, you guys. These are single sided, aren't they? Nope. Yeah. They're no. double up. They're 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 foil on one side and white on the other. That's what Thomas would say. Thomas is like, they are not single-sided. Yeah. They are white. Smarty on the pants. <laughs> Look at these. These are sentiments that are already foiled. You just cut them out and use them. There we go. Look at these. Such prettiness. Such pretty. You know, I'm doing that six by six. I am on. Did y'all want more six by six stuff? I didn't get to look at the comments this weekend. I was going to ask Tamitha, did they want more or was three enough? I love to take a six by six and turn it into something like little 3D things. So that video was a lot of fun to make. And I would love to show y'all some more ideas. I just don't know if you said yes or no. <laughs> Pitta. Pitta. You call them Pitta or you said poinsettia? Probably I called them Pitta. Look at me putting things away. Is there a rule for bubble cutting? Yes. Don't cut your finger? There is a rule for bubble cutting. Have fun. Don't stress. I'm telling you, that's all there is to it. I enjoyed the little six by six thingy. All right. This one is first Christmas. Brace yourself because this is so cute. Here's the wood page. Look at this. Look how cute these babies are. Look at this little nativity. Oh, my goodness. We had this in 12 by 12. Do we not? We may or may not. I don't know. What was it's the name absolutely of it? gorgeous. This one is called um, First Christmas. This paper rose paper is so pretty too. Look at that. Can I just have that little donkey? That donkey's fast. He's not fast. He's solemn. He's quiet. We He's do sweet. still have some um, 12 by 12. So we have this in the 12 by 12 too. Charlotte, <laughs> it's not always yes, Charlotte. I could ask a question and y'all be like, no. I don't think so. I could ask some questions. No. I mean, if you asked us if we wanted to offer and stuff, we'd say no. Or Tennessee. Not Charlotte, stuff. she's changing her ways. You trying to make her mad. <laughs> I never pick on Charlotte. She picked on me. I never pick on her. I did one time. She's gonna be mad at me. She won't be, y'all. Charlotte won't be mad. <laughs> okay. I use this card. I use this to make a card we never brought to them. So I had the bright idea of making y'all like, I don't know, 137 cards, different cards in July. It didn't work out. I brought you a bunch, but I made a card with this that I thought was going to be so cute and so fun. And I'm just going to tell y'all something. It made me want to cry. I've never made a card that made me want to cry. Now I need to do a video of the card that made me want to cry because some of y'all might not cry about it. It was bad. We cried about it. We have a t-shirt that says there's no there's crying, no crying in crafting. Oh, it I was. I didn't cry. It was, the, it was not crafting. It was creating a craft. The that card we were that made me want to cry is what I need to do. Or it did say she loved you either way. <laughs> she loves me. I know that. Hey, look. Oh, he failed. These are beautiful. And I will I will do that if y'all want me to. If y'all want me to do the card that, that almost made me cry. It was to the point that I said, Shannon, this, we're cutting this. And we had made, we had had it, we prepped it and all that. And I was like, this is We got it. to a point of, we're not doing it. they are going to hate us. They will be mad at me about this card. And not do any of the other cards with will, this one in it. They will feel like I've let them down. <laughs> it was, but I'll bring it to you. <laughs> it 
was rough. Let me know when. I'm going to be sick of you. <laughs> You've run into that card a time or two, Amy says. No, the card was bad. No, Miss Joan. It's not even so much I was being critical of myself. The design of the card, I thought, oh, that's simple enough. Let's do that one. I guess the problem was I tried to do it in an as many as. Because, you know, at, in July, I tried to bring you a lot of as many as options. And it, you just have to see it. And you'll be like, why did you do this to yourself? And it I'm was, like, it was as many as headaches. I still have it um, set up. That's yeah, we have it all separated. He said as a blooper. As a blooper. It was bad. What me and Shannon said about that card? I said, Shannon, I'm not doing this card on camera. <laughs> I'm just not. I said, this will just make people mad. Like, we were having to lay the card out, tape all the pieces, because you had to keep the pieces in a certain spot. So, it, it was so just it pain. Fit. Yeah, it was and just And it's pain. not the only card we did. We had another card we were working on. I wish we had filmed this process, y'all. We had another card we were working on, and we had... Was it eight pieces of cardstock? I think so. Cut down into shapes that then you divvied out and put back together uh -huh. to put on the front of a card. Yeah. And for some reason, I thought that won't be hard. It took us two days to shuffle the cardstock. We were like, how are we ever going to teach them how to do this? It's so hard. Yeah. It, but it, it kind of looked easy, but it was not hard. Could you ink blend over the foil? Not with rate, not with pigment or dye ink. I don't think you'd have to use like a stay zone, but that doesn't that doesn't blend very well. Cindy asked, "What was the stamp set you used on the diagonal on the card that had Merry Christmas done diagonal?" I think that was the, the one greatest we did. stamp set we brought out this year. Honestly, I love that set. Um, Jasmine's cleaning up stamps, so I'm not sure where it is, but it's called "Say It Mary." Say it, Mary. I'm telling y'all, if may you be haven't out, got it, I know we, it was in on our list of stuff we just ordered. If you so. haven't got it, you need to get it as soon as it comes back. It's so good. Lita, let me tell you something. Listen, Linda. Listen, Lita. <laughs> Shannon and I, in July, we had these boards. We have these things we post on the wall that we write on. And we decided they're not boards, they're posted, big posted. We decided we were going to design our card, I mean, our videos on those. And so we went out online and we started looking at card ideas and we would like get pictures and stuff and paste them on there and all this. Well, we had one video we were going to bring to you that was like eight Christmas cards that let the paper do the work or yeah. something like that. And we're like, this won't be a problem. We'll get this done. Da, 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 da. It was a problem. Like it, the, so many of those cards that we thought didn't look so bad were really hard to do. And again, Making one of them would not have been a problem. We were trying to do it where we could show you, look, if you've got six pieces of this, you can make this many of these is what we were trying to do. Y'all know, you saw how we did that a lot for the um, July. Trent said, I mean, ink blend around the full so the sentiments aren't oh, white. Yeah, the white, you should be able to ink the white this around the mine. sentiment. Mine is over there. I know this isn't mine. Um, but y'all should see some of the stuff <clears throat> Some of the stuff is that we tried to do was rough. Shannon, how many of what we picked? Did we do five of what we picked? Maybe four, five. We ended up going no. They will not like this. We said no. Uh, it's still slicky paper. Let's just see. Let's <clears throat> cut one out. I just put the scissors on. Read what Alan, I can't read what. I know what many Alan cards we start. Was, oh, sorry. Well, that's weird. I can't. Go I know it. many cards we start and wish we didn't. LOL. Or is more difficult. How many people have a half done card because it's too hard or not right? That really blended well. And I got to be honest, that paper took that ink well. It did. Let me do it on the back. That really, that's really doing pretty good. I'll hold it up. I'll hold it up with half done. That really blended well. Almost like one of those pages, almost like cards like that's made for ink blending. It did really good. You know, that's interesting too, because I noticed Paper Rose and their samples do a lot of ink. And I thought, I wonder what ink they're using on that card sock, but that worked perfect. 
Thank you, Trent. That was a good thing to make me try. It turned out really good. I mean, of course, you could use color. It'd be even prettier. But that was a good idea. Learn something new. And wait. All right, guys. That is it for today. I am going to bring this back to you. Well, I'll keep working on it. I've got some other things I want to do. I think this is my favorite so far. i got to do something really cool inside here, too. Wouldn't it be cool? Why do I do this to myself on camera? Save it for later. I can't. Wouldn't it be cool if these had pop-up elements? When you opened it, if something popped up here? You see what I'm saying? It wouldn't be hard to do. But wouldn't it be cute? I say that. And what I'm going to cry over it. And then, what do you mean pop-up elements? Like if you opened this and something here popped. Oh. Like was lifted. I get what you're saying. So, and then if you had like something that went, oh. <laughs> So that will be a video for five weeks down the road after she's tried, cried. After I've and cried, tried, cried, and cried. No. All right, guys. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> I wanted to say, blah. where's Amanda? She does lights. Can she do sound? So whenever. <laughs> yeah, Lisa, I'm glad you're liking it. We're hoping that people are enjoying the Tuesday shows. We're hearing a lot of you guys are. And you guys are watching them in the replay, too. So that's really good. Um, you can do the four attached cards on a page. That was a quick one. I'm trying to think what that was. Leaves on wobbles. That would be cute too. I think it'd be fun to have something like pop up and frame a picture or something in there. We'll see what we can do. Cindy, you're so sweet. Thanks, Tina. I got to, um, are you coming in today for real? I have a question for you. Um, Oh, Amy, I'm so sorry. We'll end it so you won't have to um, wait too long to go back. Um, Benny, why don't you close us in prayer? I'll do it. Let's pray, guys. Hey, God, thanks for the day. Thank you for this time that we can share together with our friends here on YouTube and Facebook. And God, I just pray that today um, you received honor and glory from the things that we did, the laughs that we had, and the fun that we had together. Lord, we love you. We praise you, God. So many people are still struggling and still going through hard times. But God, we know you're able. So we faithfully trust you uh, to take care of all of our needs. And Lord, we love you again. Thank you for your son, Jesus, who died for us. In Christ's name, amen. Amen. All right, you guys, we'll see you Thursday night for our next live. And until then, have a good one. Bye, Bye now. now.